Hi, this is Gary with MacMost Now. On today's episode, let's look at how to sort and arrange files in the Finder in Mac OS X Lion. So Lion really did change some things about how you look at files in Finder windows. Let's examine those changes and learn how to use them. So here's a Finder window with my Documents folder. Now as before you've got four viewing modes. You have the Icon Viewing Mode, you have List View, Column View, and Cover Flow which is really just List View with the Cover Flow at the top. So we can go back to Icon View and start there. Now under Icon View you see these icons and one of the questions I get asked is how do you change the size of these icons and there's a little control down here. Uh, if you don't see that control go to View and show the status bar. See if I hide it it goes away. Now once you have them the right size you may want to sort them and there's two different things that you can do here. Uh, one is clean up and the other is arrange by. And arrange by is very new. So clean up works as before. It will actually resort all of the files. Let's do that clean up by name. And you can see it's resorted all the files into the size of the window I have and it's sorted them by name. That's a permanent change. I've just moved everything so it's there and I can't undo it. Now if I also want to use the arrange by function there I can select something like say let's arrange by kind. And you can see it divides up all of the things here into various groups. Here I've got a group of folders and a group of documents and it puts them in separate places. Also it gives me this kind of cover flow look. Uh, you can see here I have more documents to the right. If I use two finger scrolling on my trackpad I can move back and forth and look at all these items here. Now you don't have the ability to do much more when you're using the arrange by function. So you want to check to make sure that if you want to do something like clean things up or, or whatever you want to put arrange by to none. Let me show you in list view exactly how that works. In list view here I can in normal list view sort by name. I can click there to sort by size. I can reverse the sort. All sorts of things. But if I switch to arrange by and say arrange by kind I don't have the ability to sort by any of those things anymore. It's because it would kind of get confusing. You'd have this group sorted by something and then this group sorted by something else. So if you want that kind of sorting you want to make sure you set arrange by to none. And also note you've got all these different arrange view options here. Like for instance size is kind of interesting. It groups them by size of the document. The arrange by name it's kind of the most useless out of all of them. It basically gives you a view that looks like you're not arranging them in any way and it has a permanent sort. You can't actually click up in the column view to change anything. So if you want to set it to arrange by none that's when you get control back of arranging everything by columns. Now one of the cool things about arrange by is I can go into column view and I can still use arrange by even though I can't sort in column view. I can say arrange by kind and you can see that columns are arranged by kind. If I then select a folder here, and let's find a folder with stuff, stuff in it, you can see that that column is also arranged by kind. So then I can even go and arrange by, say, size, and then it will arrange the each column by size in there. So that could be useful. Now, just like before, you can go to View, Show View Options, and you get many more options here and it all depends upon what view you're in. So for instance that's a list view. You can see what I get. I get uh, which columns to be shown, arrange by and sort by are there. But I could also go to icon view. Now I have icon size and grid spacing and things like that. And in column view I've got a different set of settings as well. But the arrange by is shown there just as you have access to it up here. Another new thing is the All My Files folder. So this gives you a view of basically all of your files and they're arranged by kind by default. But you can set that to something else. And this will show you all the files that you have in all the different folders inside your user folder. Now the My is the key word there. It's all of your files. So it doesn't include things that would be say owned by the system or owned by other users uh, there on your Mac. Now of course it's important to note that your files are still in the same place. For instance your documents are probably still in your users documents folder. 
These are just different ways of finding and sorting the files in Finder windows and of course in Open and Save dialogs as well. Now remember the new Arrange by function is completely optional. Just set it to None and then Finder windows basically operate like they did in Snow Leopard. So you don't have to use these new features if you don't want to or only use them at selected times. Hope you found this useful. Till next time this is Gary with MacMost Now. Want more video tutorials? Just go to MacMost.com, click on the Videos link at the top of the page and then you can view all of the hundreds of MacMost videos by category.